What do you see? This is your boy Sheriff Speaks, and today I want to talk to you guys about the show Frequency. It just aired last week. This is the pilot. Um, it follows the story of a girl named by the name of Ramey Sullivan, who becomes a detective and meets, who interacts with her father in a, through a ham radio from 1996. Her father died on it, working a quote-unquote sting operation around 21st of October 1996, which would led to his murder. And for years, she's harbored this hatred towards him because he never was really there for her as a father. You know, just a typical thing. You know, I think that's the big, one big compromise and or sacrifice that police officers make day to day when it comes to their family. They don't spend as much time with them. So then that child feels abandoned by them. And so her boyfriend in one particular timeline, and we'll get to that later, explaining that later. Um, finds a ham radio and she t tells him that this is something that her father we used to always do together you know they used to talk to try to talk to astronauts up in space and so as she's going about her, on about her day she realizes that the ham radio works suddenly and she's trying to figure out well how does it work and it turns out the, the, radio, the ham radio con is connected to the year 1996 you know it's parallel to her universe which is 2016 and at first, like anyone else, typically people, we, they trip out. And I can't believe it, you know. And then she tells them not to go because not to go to this one location. I believe a Harbor 34, you know, to go. Because, you know, her father was undercover. It was an undercover cop, you know. And the day that his death, they said that he was a dirty cop because he got involved in a quote-unquote sting operation when, when in fact, she has... As we all find out, and as Ramey finds out, that it was a setup by his own lieutenant, Lieutenant Moreno. And, you know, throughout the episode, she, she tries to really connect the dots, trying to figure out, well, well, wait a second, why did my father get killed that night? Was it really a sting operation, as anyone said? And throughout the end, while she's speaking with her father through the ham radio, he says, it wasn't a sting. Why, why would anyone say it? Because Why? Because it's a top secret. And she tells him that he dies there. And so when he hears that, you know, you know, he goes through with it, but things change. Instead of him dying there, he survives. Only thing is, in place of his death is his own wife. Because that night, they were also trying to figure out who the killer of, I believe called the Night Wrangler or something like that. Trying to figure out who that killer is because he killed nurses at night. It turns out his wife, his ex-wife, Julie Sullivan, ends up getting killed instead while she's in the elevator with the young Ramey at eight years old, visiting her father in the hospital, who then also brings the ham radio to her father. So then, because older Ramey wants to deliver that father a specific message, to possibly tell him that our mother, my mother dies instead. And so, Ramey, Ramey is both able to recount events from the past and her future because you know now that she's learned this information her father's alive her mother dies and the boyfriend that she thought she had who was probably going to be her fiance because at one point you know she found a ring in one of his boxes finds out she she shows up at the restaurant where in, in the previous timeline where she was supposed to meet with him and his parents that doesn't happen because they don't know each other she's erased that existence from the timeline and so she can't believe it she can both see things from the past and the future see both the future and the past and it's kind of crazy that way so i'm really curious to see how this week's episode plays out you know again this was the pilot and it started off first it was a little weird for me at first you know i had to get a little used to it but I'm, i think i am pretty intrigued by it you know now and i look forward to seeing what next week has to hold up um, this is your boy Shaver Sweet, and if you guys like this video, subscribe to the channel and all that other, you know, all the other jazz for more content. Um, and I will also be reviewing this show, Frequency, Arrow, and possibly Supergirl, or Supergirl as well. You know, because I'm really into DC comics and stuff like that, and Marvel as well. But whatever I just like, you know, I like to watch. But again, subscribe to the channel and all that other jazz. One love, y'all.